Are you cooking, sir? Are you cooking? Oh, you're trying it too. YouTube, what is up, guys? I am filming a little vloggy episode at my house. And uh, it's, it's kind of tough because, no, well, filming this isn't tough, but uh, <laughs> quarantine life is not boring for me. It is very fast action, and I have been getting behind on things that I'm trying to get done. So that's today's goal. I've got a scratch on my lens. You see that? I literally just bought this. It's things like this every single day. Scratches on lens. Uh, no, but we're going to have some, have fun. Why don't you uh, hang out with me during this, uh, this, this dad day? Mom's here too. Yep. It's a, it's a dad video because I'm making it. I don't know. It's tough. It's tough getting all this stuff done, dude. Because I got to take care of you. I got to clean up after you. I've got to do work. I've got to clean the, the, the counter. Good. I got to taste your brownies or cake or cupcakes. What are you, what are you eating? You're going to hit that. What are you doing? I'm talking to my friend um, and making a clock. For school? Yeah. Okay, that's the important part because that was <laughs> a weird sentence before then. Talking to my friend and making a clock. Toast, are you ready for this rainy day? Are you ready for your rainy day? Baby, baby toasty. I keep trying to get my like editing and emails and stuff done for the morning, but this is another reason why it's hard to be a dad is that you're playing in your ball pit. What, do you have a tape measure? Do you hear, pull it, pull it. More, he's signing more. We, we teach our kids more sign language early on, and boy, do they use it. All right, here, hold on. It was very cute when you were in your ball pit, Cyrus. Oh, you did it. You did it. Yeah, you press that button. Here, wanna do it again? You hold that. What, what, what? no, hold that, hold that. It doesn't, buddy, see, this is, this is why it's hard to get work done. Okay, all right, you were being you were being a little aggressive. I love you. Okay, so sadly I had to break my child's heart because I wouldn't let him punch my computer. I am gonna get some stuff done today though. I have a list, okay? And on this list, can you guys read it? I have a, a crazy amount of boxes that need process in the garage. I need to build Cyrus's car that he got for Christmas. That's the epitome of being a parent, is doing something five months after you got it. I need to clean my office yet again. Quality time after Ryden finishes his schoolwork. And then I'm finally... Yeah, buddy, it's still not there. Well, don't, don't get it. I can't even tell you guys a list. All right, it's okay, I'll get it for you. Bottle flip. Oh, well, you almost you almost did it. Try it. Well, you gotta throw it up. And then, I'm finally going to try to skateboard. I don't know if you guys saw my live stream uh, two days ago, but I have been injured, and I don't know how. It's a ghost injury. I have a heel bruise from doing nothing. Or I don't know how it happened, uh, but I'm gonna try to skateboard today for the first time in like a week. All of these boxes need to be cut down to go inside a box. And it sucks because I can't just shove all these things in my recycling. So I gotta like severely cut them up and that's what I'm doing now. It's the first task. I've been wanting to do it for like a week and it's gotten this bad. Just from like unpacking things that we never unpacked, like cleaning and these boxes just like, they just, whatever. The good thing is that you don't have to do this. You just get to see a quick montage of me doing it and it's gonna be done. I wish I was you right now. Oh my gosh, I wish I was you. This takes up a lot less space now. Okay, that, that is so good that that's done. I got into two boxes and uh, that's progress. And now I gotta build a car, but you better believe that I'm going in to cross boxes off my list. Boxes. Now I'm gonna go get started on Cyrus's car, but first we need to go over your book, dude. Okay? okay. What chapters did you read? You read four chapters today. Yeah. That's good. All right, so every time after his reading, I usually quiz him a few things from those chapters to make sure he did it. And you've been rocking this book. You like this book so far? Yeah. Who does Lindy think is doing it? It. I don't get what it. Like the, the horrible thing they're talking about. Lindy. Yes, Lindy says that she's been doing it. Who did Chris walk home uh, with after school? Cody. Yes, Cody. What did Mr. Wood start saying to the Millers? Like what kinds of things? Mean things. How? Name one. Is that a mustache or is it a rat? Yeah. Correct. They didn't like that, did they? No. You're getting near the end. That's when it's gonna get really scary and exciting. All right, back to your school work, kiddo. Well, I'm gonna eat lunch. Oh, you're doing lunch? Yeah. Actually, 
What time is it? Maybe I should do lunch before going to the car. Cheese crisps, guacamole, and Picard. Which, this show is intense. It is like the most mature Star Trek series ever, but it's good. I'd like to talk to you about your two recent visits with Admiral Picard. To your personal access display device. Now I get to build this car, which my wife started doing, um, and then she realized that it wasn't just like a quick thing and she didn't have time. So I'm finishing it and we will, I'm gonna let Cyrus ride in this later and it's gonna be the time of his life. He loves any little vehicle that he can roll around on. I'm, at, I'm way more excited to do this than the boxes, which makes sense, right? I see what she was saying though. This is a ton of stuff. You think it would just come out of the box and you'd play with it. Oh no, now this is gonna be satisfying. Oh, it's coming together. Remember that every kid had that yellow and red car that you push around like a Flintstone when they're growing up? I'm pretty sure it just came in a box. Like, I didn't. I don't think you had to make it yourself. I also am not sure of that. And why is it green? Why isn't it just red and yellow like it always has been? You know what, there was nothing wrong with it. And they were like, we should probably fix it anyway because every kid wants to be riding around in a piece of broccoli. We got wheels. Well, we got half of them. It's done. So uh, that's awesome. Oh, there's some stuff that I actually need to put on, but either way, he'll, I'm, I'm done with this. I gotta move on to other stuff. He's sleeping right now, so uh, he unfortunately can't use it now, but in this video, later on, we will show Cyrus's car. It's gonna be so awesome. Cyrus's car, done. He's a car? He does now. I'm not gonna be able to do office cleaning, right? I'm not gonna be able to clean my office because I need to do a live stream for YouTube. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, you're gonna hang out with me on it. Yeah. Do you want to? You don't have to. Mm, I might call Bunny. Cool, if you want to hang out with your friend. Next week. Yeah. I'm doing a live stream right there. The room's a mess, I'm sorry, I deal with it. And where'd my chat go? Oh, a Brody says you should see Aaron Cairo again at the Braille House for them, like a game of skate. Yeah, I, we would. We really, we were actually supposed to go to the Braille House um, soon, and uh, this whole quarantine situation prevents us from doing that. But Aaron Cairo, I'm gonna hang out with you soon. Or eventually. I'm gonna drop the marble. It's gonna go bounce, bounce, hit. Okay, so it's a trick shot. Yeah. I have actually on my list is quality time, and I just wanna make sure that like I don't just work, work, work throughout the day, and I always take breaks and hang out with this guy. And and the, and Cyrus, but he's napping still. Ready? Yeah, do it. Oh! It's in, is it's it, in. Oh, it's, it is in there. It there is. you go. <laughs> you did it, dude. <laughs> So there you go, that's what you were making last night. Yeah. We were like, go do something, no you're not gonna be on a screen, go do something fun. Yeah. Not electronic, and this is what you came up with. Yep. Very creative, dude. I wanted to do like a marble truck made out of Legos, that would like slide down. What's stopping you? Well, I, I don't think I have enough Legos. You have enough Legos. No. Yes, you do. You have all of my old Legos, and I had enough Legos. No, I don't think I could because I, I because I wanted to go through all of the basement. You need it's to get a job at Lego for that, dude. I do. Okay, so I just wow, it's blue. So I just got a bunch of boring computer work done. Now I'm going to skateboard, and uh, this is the first time back after like a week of not skating, a stupid heel bruise. Um, so I'm gonna, I'm, it, it's, I'm just gonna test the waters. I'm gonna do some basic tricks. It's not gonna be too exciting, but it's gonna be exciting for me because I'm skating again. Hopefully, I do not make it worse. Okay, at first, when I first started, I was like, I have been, haven't skated in a month. I felt really weird, but then they started to feel really good at the end. Uh, and honestly, I can keep going. I want to keep going, but just to play it safe, I'm gonna stop there. Uh, it feels good. Wow, I've never had a heel bruise where I start skating and I'm like, oh, I waited the appropriate time. Usually it's like, you shouldn't skate, but let's do it anyway. All right, I'm gonna go get cleaned up and then we will do the car reveal to the little one. Hey, come here, give me your hand. Let's go, let's go put shoes on, I got a surprise for you. Put in the shoes on Cyrus. All right, you ready to go, let's go. 
You need to clean up your room, sir. I get it. Get in. Get in there. Dude, here, your leg. All right, we're gonna close the door. <laughs> Look. Are you in a car? Do you like it? Yay. Yeah, I know, I need to turn it into a dinosaur. It's a dinosaur, by the way. It is? Yep, it, uh, I gotta put things on it. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> you like it, Toast? <laughs> you like it? Oh, good, buddy. One more thing, Cyrus. Start your car. Twist, twist. There you go. <laughs> Whoa, you're going backwards! Oh my gosh, are you? Oh, 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 oh! You just got into your first car wreck. Are you gonna leave the scene of the crime? It was green, by the way. It was green because it's not broccoli, it's supposed to be a dinosaur, you get it now. Okay, that was the best thing ever. Uh, yeah, so it's funny, because I did this video just kind of wanting to go over like how difficult it is sometimes to get things done. Like, I have my list right here, and I, I, aside from editing and basic taking care of the house and stuff, uh, I, I got four out of five things done on my list, and that's, that's pretty good, honestly. This is one of the easier days, I feel like. The baby took a long nap. I knocked it out. My office is never gonna get cleaned, but I just have to accept that. Uh, no, but I feel like people look at parenthood like this big, ominous, dark cloud. A lot, a lot of some people do, like not everyone. And uh, it really, it, it isn't, and it doesn't have to be that. The best, your best ammunition at being a parent is a good attitude, as cheesy as that is. It goes a long way. There are gonna be good days, and there's gonna be difficult days, and uh, in the end, it's, it's the best thing every single day. It really is. The ups and the downs, it's just like, it's such a great experience. I see some people talking about quarantine, and they're like, the one thing I'm glad I don't have during this is kids, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I would go crazy if I didn't have kids right now, because every day would be a mushy, same thing like a big just mush the week is mush uh, and the kids make it every single day like just that out there seeing him in his car uh, it's just like the most it's it's the best it's like such a heartwarming experience um, so to parents out there if it is tough you're not alone everyone's having their own experience with this uh, but like I said having a good attitude goes a long way it's I don't know it's the thing that I'm gonna preach when it comes to parenting I've said it in other videos I'm gonna just forever preach that this is just the rambling nonsense of my mind uh, quarantine I can't believe it's been six it's been six weeks babe she you she's been you've been seven it's insane granted I know like I'm, tr I'm not trying to stand on like a high horse because we've got it like you know we've got it good with these little dudes we got two genuine little dudes. So there's my piece. I hope that made sense. I hope it wasn't crazy. Um, uh, thank you for hanging out with me today. I do want to do a shout out to Detroit Grooming. They just sent me this. They don't know that I'm about to tell you that I'm about to feature them in a video. Where'd the, where'd the soap go? They sent me a little care package with like hand soap and lip balm and then shirts. Uh, and they totally customized it. Look at this. That's a, that's a revive symbol. And then I noticed, and then it took me a second, but there's a four symbol right there. Super nice of them. Uh, they hang out with me on my live streams. So uh, I'll put a link to their website if you want to check it out, if you have a beard or lips or hands. If you have any of those, they probably have some product for you. And uh, just thank you. Thank you, Detroit Grooming, because uh, this shirt is insanely comfortable. I was, uh, when I, I looked at the box today and I was like, oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a shower and I'm gonna get into that shirt and it's gonna be good. I'm gonna go check out why that baby is crying. If you guys want skateboarding gear, I have you at the shredcores.com. If you have a local shop in your area, check out if they're doing some sort of curbside service. Uh, they can like, or like at least mine in Cincinnati, you roll up and they'll come out to your car and do the transaction and bring you your skateboarding gear and you don't have to get out. And that would be awesome. You can absolutely support your local scene and if you want one of our products, they can always carry our gear. But if not, we have you at the shredcores.com. I do videos all the time and I'm gonna keep doing them 
even if I'm stuck in quarantine for the rest of my life. My, my gosh, I hope we're not. That's it, I'm done. Cyrus, you wanna say bye to the YouTube video? He laughed and pointed at the food. It's dinner time, you guys have a good one. Peace out. They are above the surface of the ground. Worms will also feed on fruits, berries, and vegetables. However, if they are below ground, they may also feed on algae, fungi.